Not bad. Not bad at all. And it was just as impressive when I built it two weeks ago. Why did we wait so long to hold our housewarming party? I'm not the one who wanted custom musical invites for everybody. Hex, the baseline alone took you four days to write. I wanted it to be special. This is kind of a big deal. Goatface finally made himself some friends. Knock it off. They're your friends, too. Cut them some slack. Who knows what kind of robot stuff they're up to. I know, I know. It's just... I don't want to be late. I can't remember the last time I was invited to something like this. It was seven days ago. I've invited you over for dinner every Saturday since you started working here. You never come, but that's not the point. I... uh... look, it's... There you are. What took you? Sorry, I was doing research. Research? I'll explain later. I'm not ready to share my hypothesis. Further investigation is required. Everything you say sounds so serious. Sorry, I didn't mean to raise suspicion. Interesting. Yes. It certainly is. So, what do we think? It's a rectangle! Yes, Neojog, it is. However, I was more interested in the opinions of the people who hadn't seen it yet. Oh, right. Oh, all right. All right. Okay. It is a big rectangle. It looks a lot like an apartment building. Yes, indeedy. We've stuffed this thing chock full of extra rooms. No offense meant, good buddy, but spending years together with zero privacy takes a toll on you. It's nice to sleep without being serenaded by the humming of a certain someone's motors. You're one to talk. Of everyone I've ever bunked with, you snore the loudest. I'm the only one you've ever bunked with. My, my point still stands. I guess I'm talking. There's even a room for you, Hem. With me? But I already have an apartment. Your apartment is literally a broom closet. It's a broom closet with class. Plus, I kind of like being able to walk downstairs and be at work. I'm almost never late. Lazy bones. Okay, so you're lazy. Moving you in would be all kinds of illegal. You already live here. You've already got an apartment that I'd like to be invited back to sometime. So that leaves... No, but a roommate is enough, thanks. Fair enough. Well, good buddy, we've just scored ourselves four closets. Sweet, I finally got a place for my lab stuff. Lab stuff? You have lab stuff?
many years just running away. I would have done anything just to be able to stay. I've been to so many places and left them behind. And so I slept alone at night. I spent so many years fighting day after day. Could we have skipped all of that if I just knew what to say? I would have done anything just to leave you behind. How can I know that I was right? Um, are things okay? Well, uh, I got a bit of a headache, and my HUD is still messed up from when Glitch Kid attacked me, but... No, I mean, with us. I've known you for three years, and we've never done anything together except work. I'm sorry, I've just been busy. Every weekend? For three years? Why do you go to anything Goatface hosts, but not me? Do you not like me? Oh, I mean, I do. When Goatface invites us to places, it's never alone. But when it's just me, I don't know. It feels like a mistake, or you're only doing it because you feel bad. I know it's not like that, but I can't shake the feel. Why would people as funny and smart and as beautiful as you want to spend time with a loser like me? Hem, are you depressed? I need to go. Uh, lay down. Headache, you know? Uh, yeah, dude. Of course. Hey, while you're up there, could you grab my other keyboard for me? Yeah, sure. <laughs>